Botanical Brian here at Colonial Gardens. Many people don't know it, but we have a working farm right here at Colonial Gardens. We have pigs and cows and a beautiful orchard and berries. And today we're gonna go look at our blackberry patch. Let's roll. <laughs> Over to the left is our apple trees. These are going to be ready for fall. You pick in the fall. Beautiful apple trees, all different varieties. Here's the apricots. And peaches. And here is our berry patch. There are tons, literally tons, of berries coming. Cool, let's end on Will. So I want to introduce you to our orchardist, Will. Will, thank you for having us out here today. Thanks for coming out and checking it out. Will, what kind of berries do we grow here at Colonial Farms? Well, we've got blackberries, we've got raspberries, we have black raspberries, we have goji berries and elderberries. Awesome. Well, I call this the berry patch. I often hear you refer to it as the bramble patch. What does that mean, the bramble patch? So bramble, it, may, it mainly describes anything in the, the rubus genus, which is, uh, which is all your thorny, bushy, thick uh, plants that they, they all grow the um, aggregate fruits like you see here. So they all have these tiny little droplets on them. And so there's over 750 varieties in the rubus genus. And, and so that contains, you know, your big three or your blackberries, your raspberries and your dewberries. So I see they're coming on and they're almost ready. What, what are the harvest periods for our berries here at Colonial Gardens? So our berries are finally putting on their purple color, as you can see. And our harvest time, well, it'll probably start in um, early June, well, late June and um, into, into uh, late July. Are berries easy to grow? Absolutely, they're very easy to grow. And do you need a trellis system, an elaborate trellis system like you have here, which no. is really cool. No, you don't need an elaborate trellis system. You can get away with a couple of T-posts in the ground and, and a, a tight line. And as long as they're up off the ground, then you're, you're ready to go. I understand that berries need specific type of pruning. Uh, how do you prune these berries? So typically in the, in the spring, when they, start, when they start putting out their new spring growth, we're gonna tie them down to a line, a trellis line that's low on these plants. And once we do that, we clip the ends of them and that causes all of our, um, our nodes to explode with new growth. And they grow up the trellis and, and we trellis them up and we do that every year. Will, you're doing a very good job out here with these berries. Thank you so much for all of your information. Well, I appreciate that, Brian. That's very nice of you to say. <laughs> So if you're interested in these delicious berries that Will is growing, there are several ways that you can get a hold of these berries. You can come and do you pick here at our uh, berry patch. You can go to our Colonial Market and get the berries at our Colonial Market, or you can try the berries at our brand new Colonial Farms restaurant called uh, Colonial... Colonial Kitchen. Colonial Kitchen. And so come on in and try these awesome berries.